Hey, 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 what's up champions? Gediminas here. Hope you guys are doing fantastically well. And today I wanted to talk about what makes a great team. So if you're watching a replay of this video, please do me a massive favor and say hashtag replay into the comments. And if you're brand new, if you're watching one of my videos for the first time, please do say new in the comments as well, because I'd love to welcome you to the tribe. And of course, if you get some value from this video, or you learn something, feel free to share it. Maybe somebody else will get some value too. Uh, hey, Sarah. Hey, Rita. Thanks for jumping on, guys. Hey, Lilia. Nice to see you. Nice to see you guys. Happy Sunday. So the title of this video, what makes a great team? And... If I asked you to describe what is a team, you know, what, 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 what is a team? What makes a great team? Uh, the chances are a lot of you would say, well, it's a group of people who are the same, right? Who, who are doing the same. So it's, it's like a group of people who, who are the same, right? But actually, what makes a really great team is a group of people that are not the same. Hey, Yeva. Hey, Yurata. Hey, Sierra. Hey, Irina. Uh, hey, Demante. Uh, nice to see you guys. Hey, Irina. So actually, if you think about it, what makes a great team um, is actually a bunch of people who are different, but they can complement each other. They can supplement each other. Because think about if you had a football team with 11 goalkeepers, wouldn't be much of a great football team, would it? Right. Or what if you had a basketball team with five, you know, attackers, right? Again, wouldn't make a great basketball team, but because who's going to be defending? Who's going to be doing that and the other, right? So a great team is actually a bunch of different people who know different things. You see, because the challenge is as a leader, very often you are looking for people like you <laughs> because you're your favorite person in the world. <laughs> you like yourself. You're awesome, right? You're a rock star. So you look for more people like yourself, right? So you want people who think like you. You want people who behave like you. You want people who are disciplined like you. You want people who do things like you, right? But the challenge is if you only get people like you, one, you're missing out on like three quarters of the population of the earth <laughs> because you're going to disqualify three quarters of people because they are not like you, right? That's one. And number two then is you have the whole team of people like you, which means all of you have the same strengths and the same weaknesses. <laughs> so like if you're rubbish in technology, then your whole team is rubbish in technology because you're only recruiting people like you. You know what I mean? A great team and a great leader is actually a person who's looking for people who are better than him in certain areas, right? So if I'm a, a, a leader who's a great speaker, I might not look to recruit great speakers, but of course I will if I find them, right? But, but if I'm a great speaker, but I'm not a great seller, guess what? I'll look for people who are great at selling to recruit them into my team. If I'm a great speaker, but I'm not great at technology, I'll look to recruit somebody who's great at technology. If I'm, a, if I'm not a great speaker, then I'll look to recruit somebody who's a great speaker. If I'm not great at, you know, psychology or whatever, I'll look for some, you know what I mean? So if you look at most successful business people in the world, you know, people like Richard Branson, like Bill Gates, like Steve Jobs, like Elon Musk, they are not superhuman geniuses. Well, they are geniuses, but they are not perfect in everything. They don't know everything in, in the entire planet, but what they do, they hire people who know more than them in certain areas, right? And that's how they get incredible results, right? That's how they can run 10, 20, 30, 40 different companies and all companies are thriving because they are looking for talent. They're looking for people who are better than them at different things. So the same thing actually applies for your network marketing business too. When you're looking for people, you know, I know, and I keep hearing this all the time from people like, well, I, I'm looking for anybody. Like everybody fits into my team. Everybody can work with me. And yeah, I know that everybody can work with you. But why not change that? Because you know, when you're looking for everybody, usually you get nobody. Why not laser focus and say, okay, who do I actually need in my team? What type of people do I need in my team? What skills do I need in my team? And start looking for people like that and actually approach people and go, hey, Sonia, I'd love to um, show you my business. I'd love to share my business with you. I'd love to have you in my team because you're doing this, right? And I need that in my team. You, you have the talent that will help you in my business. 
Hey Claire, you know, I would love to share with you my business opportunity because you do this and I really need that in my team and I think you could crush it in my business because you're really good at that. You know what I mean? So this will serve you both as a recruiting tool because now you're giving somebody a reason why they should join your business. You're giving them a reason why they would be great at your business and at the same time, you are genuinely assembling the A-team. You're assembling a team of people who are talented in different areas where you're not talented. <laughs> you know what I mean? So it's really, really, really great way of building a strong leadership team, right? So that's my advice for you for today, guys. Hope you found it valuable. If you did, feel free to share it. And also, if you're already in home-based business and you'd like to get my free training on 26 different ways how to get more sales and get more customers, head over to uh, titaniumsuccess.co.uk forward slash sales and you'll be able to download a free training from there. You ha guys have a great rest of the evening. See you at the top. Bye for now.